Helen Taylor slid into your DMs? She actually did. Welcome to Ms. Mojo. And today, we're counting down our picks for the top 10 celebs you didn't know met over social media. That's how everyone meets nowadays, yeah. which is through the freaking internet. And, uh, we, we met on the internet. We met on a, a dating, dating app. app. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. Bear with us. Come join us. For this list, we're looking at modern celebrity love stories that reportedly have social media to thank for bringing them together. While not all of these couples initially made contact with each other online, the World Wide Web was definitely the catalyst that eventually got them to date. Feel free to slip into our comments section and leave us your thoughts. Number 10. Dylan Sprouse and Barbara Palvin Baby. I'm gonna hit a corner. Oh. Mwah. What's up? You look nice. What's the occasion? Sprouse and Hungarian model Palvin have been living a sweet life together ever since they started dating back in the summer of 2018. But how did they get together in the first place? They're actually quite private about their love life, but what details are known is that while they first met at a party, they didn't actually communicate any interest in each other until Palvin started following Sprouse on Instagram after that chance encounter. You make me feel very, like, comfortable in a way that sometimes I have trouble with communicating. According to Sprouse, quote, She followed me, so I was like, I guess I'll give her something, and I slid into her DMs. However, Palvin, feeling like she, quote, wasn't in a good mindset at the time, didn't slide back until six months later. She ultimately went to visit Dylan in China, where he was filming a movie, and as of 2021, they're still going strong. Let's plan our future, baby. Number 9. Simone Biles and Jonathan Owens I love him. We have a great time together. Our personalities match right up. We have the same sense of humor. This union began with a slide into the DMs, with the girl making the first direct message contact. As Biles describes it, she saw Owens, a football player for the Houston Texans, on a celeb dating app and thought he was cute, so she said hi. It's crazy when you come across someone who is also at you know, an elite level in sports, it's just kind of an interesting dynamic. They started chatting and FaceTiming, and then one day, Simone's younger sister grabbed the phone and invited Jonathan to come on a trip to a lake house. This lake house didn't have a time-traveling mailbox, but Biles and Owens didn't need one to fall head over heels for each other. He's an athlete too, so we really understand each other, and I think that's why it, the, our relationship has been seamless. Number 8. Amy Schumer and Ben Hanish Are you in love? Hell yeah. Oh, you are? Oh, yeah. Schumer has been married to chef Chris Fisher since 2018, and they welcomed their son Gene into the world in 2019. However, one of Schumer's boyfriends before Chris was furniture designer Ben Hanish, whom she met online. While she doesn't name the app in her book, the description of it has people convinced it was Raya. Uh, I don't want to say the name of it unless I am an investor in that. Amy was only on the app for 40 minutes before she matched with someone, and that someone was Hanish. Her profile wasn't even up on the app for two days before she deactivated it. After exchanging messages online, they switched to the phone, and a few weeks after that, they had drinks at her place. Ultimately, they dated for about a year. Number 7. Dua Lipa and Anwar Hadid I have a confession to make, and mine was my boyfriend. Maybe the old rules say that if you meet someone IRL, then you have to continue that relationship in the real world as well. But those ain't the new rules. Just ask Dua Lipa, who met her current beau, Anwar Hadid, at a barbecue, but then slipped into the model's DMs to develop their relationship. And it worked, because the two have been pair-bonded since 2019. And while we don't know where it will lead, a good sign for fans of the couple came in the summer of 2020, when the pair adopted a puppy together. Number 6. Mandy Moore and Taylor Goldsmith It might not have the grand romance of This Is Us, but who's to say that if Instagram had been around in 1972 that Jack and Rebecca wouldn't have found each other on the platform? I miss you. And I wish you were here. Or I wish I was there. I love you. And I'll call you later, okay? Instead of finding his future wife singing in a bar one night, Taylor Goldsmith contacted Moore on IG after she posted a photo of his band's album cover with an enthusiastic caption. I was very newly on Instagram, so I didn't know all the like rules of tagging someone. And instead of a long drive out to LA, the two emailed back and forth. And as Moore puts it, And then we went on a date and the rest is history. Number 5. Sarah Paulson and Holland Taylor 
Uh, it's a long story. We met a very, very long time ago. Although Twitter can be credited with bringing these two together, the social media platform didn't even exist in 2005, the first time Paulson and Taylor first saw each other at a party. Now, older people don't always embrace new technology, but Sarah is definitely very happy that Holland isn't one of those older people. Hello! Everybody decent? Cut to 10 years later in 2015, and the women work together on a PSA and start following each other on Twitter. Started following each other on Twitter and then... That's when the 73-year-old Taylor slid into the DMs of the 32 years younger Paulson. And as of 2021, the lovebirds are still going strong. Number 4. Sarah Hyland and Wells Adams Because Here's the thing, I think we didn't want that to be known for a while, yeah. but the picture was so freaking good right. that we had to show the world. <laughs> the coupling that is Highland and Adams began back in 2017, following their subsequent breakups with their previous exes. It was also after Wells was a contestant on both The Bachelorette and Bachelor in Paradise. But as it turns out, Highland had been rooting for Adams on the series. She just like deserves a romantic experience here. She ended up following him and tweeting at him, after which Adams replied, and the online flirting went back and forth. First time anyone in that club gets laid. Later that same year, they posted a photo of themselves in Stranger Things Halloween costumes, and the cat was out of the bag. Aside from posting a photo of themselves in costume together, they didn't specifically mention anything else about their relationship status at the time, though Adams did commemorate their one-year anniversary with an Instagram post in 2018. Number 3. Ricky Martin and Juan Joseph Hey, what's going on, everyone? This is Ricky Martin and my husband, Juan Joseph. Martin and Joseph didn't just meet on Instagram, they got to know each other completely online before ever getting together in person. We're talking six months here, folks. Yeah, Martin and Joseph messaged each other for six whole months before doing anything IRL. It might sound a little Vita Loca to some, but not for these two. And for those of you with your minds in the gutter, Martin clarified, quote, We were just sending messages talking about life and existential issues. We don't know if Ricky asked Juan how he felt about black cats and voodoo dolls, but when they finally met in person, they both knew they were going to marry each other. Thank you so much for everything. I hope you enjoyed our temple. And now, get out! Number 2. Priyanka Chopra and Nick Jonas there were probably a lot of women and men who wanted to date Nick Jonas after seeing his muscular body in the video for his song Close. However, Priyanka Chopra was the only one of us that had that dream come true. Quantico star Chopra started crushing on Nick after seeing the video, and with a little nudge from a mutual friend, Jonas DM'd her on Twitter. That's all you talked about? This led to some flirty texts and a meetup at a 2017 Vanity Fair Oscar party, followed by the 2017 Met Gala. Now, date number three didn't come till over a year later, but after said date, Jonas called his mom and told her he was going to marry Chopra one day. The rest, as they say, is history. Where was our first kiss? <laughs> this is an easy game already. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Sophie Turner and Joe Jonas I'm a sucker for all things no one knows about you. Joe and Nick Jonas are brothers, and they're in a band together. But musical talent and genetics are not the only things these two good-looking guys have in common. They also have very similar modern-day meet-cutes with their beautiful wives. Around the same time a mutual friend was encouraging Nick to contact Priyanka Chopra, mutual friends of Joe and Sophie Turner were doing the same thing to the other Jonas brother. And just like Nick did, Joe listened to his friends and DM'd the Game of Thrones star. You want to be clean and fresh for your new husband, don't you? And by October of 2017, they were engaged. Two years after that, married. When it comes to finding love, sometimes a man has got to do what a man gotta do. What a man gotta do, what a man gotta do, to be totally locked up by you. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from Ms. Mojo. And be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.